Oh my god, we've been at this for two and a half hours. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I take way too long to do everything. Right, next item on the list is Minecraft and Minion Land. And I don't know how many of you actually um, play Minecraft or on the server, but um, if you are, I, there is some sort of news I have to tell you there. I've been instructed by the people I buy the server from that they are going to discontinue the server sometime, I think it's early next year. So I have to find another solution. They're offering me something else. I think it's more of a cloud-based server, which is more like my web server. So I will have to talk to my the, the, the administrators there and see what they think. I've not actually told them yet, so this is probably the first they've heard of it, if they're patrons. Hi. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> so, um... Princess Peabody, you're there making cake. Lava Tower still rules. Thank you very much for making cake. Oh, I love it that people are doing that. I really do. So, yeah, so, um, but no, I do intend to get it moved to a new server. But just be aware that there is, there is in the future at some point going to be something happening there. It should not change anything with regards to you because it, the, the, we'll just move the, um, the URL to point to the new IP address, but um, CM, thanks for the stream, go for, but my eyes only see pillow now. I totally and utterly get that. Yes, I do. Um, <laughs> thank you very much for staying this long. Uh, but of course, right, the other question is going to be, am I going to go back to Minion Land? And the answer is, I, I really do want to. I want to get the time to do it. I want to. But I've got to actually update my client because I think the server's now a new version. So I need to update everything. And it always takes a lot of planning. And so whenever I get these free moments and I think, oh, I'll log into Minion Land, I, I remember, oh, you haven't, you haven't, you haven't updated it. So then I've got to, I've got, I'm, I'm put a note saying update Minecraft and then I never get around to doing it. And then I've, it's been so long now, probably all the shaders have stopped working and so on. So it's kind of like I'm behind. I'm, I'm lagging behind. And so it's very hard to be spontaneous. So I have to make some sort of plan for it. And there's just been so much going on all the time. There's so much. And I, I, mean, I get so little time to do these sort of things. So, but, but if... If I can get that sorted, if I can get my if I can get my client sorted, I do want to visit again, maybe for a stream. And I am going to cheat this time. I've given up with the whole I need to travel there um, to see everything because it does take too long. That was my original my original thought was you guys were going to make stuff and I was going to travel around the land exploring the great things you guys had made. Uh, but there were a couple of problems with that. One, every time I logged in and did that. I'd be surrounded by people, which was fine, but it made it very difficult to see anything. <laughs> just not like facefuls of people. Um, but the second thing is, it, it just took too long to get anywhere. So, so I'm going to be doing flying and teleporting, basically, I think. The server is running with 1.12.2. Yeah, so should be able to update MC and Optifine. Yeah, but I think I'm still on 1.10. That's how far back I am. So, yeah. But what, when I get it updated, if I get it working, which I hope I'll get it working, I will, uh, I will try and log on and come and see some of the things you guys have created. Um, because every time I go there, I see so many things that are just incredible. A lot of the builds are better seen up, uh, from up high anyway. I can believe that. I can absolutely believe that to get the real effect. But I have to say, I have to say, there's a little side of me likes discovering things like that from the explorer's point of view. You know, like like just that pyramid someone built to discover that walking along and have it just appear over the horizon and slowly, you know, you realize what you're looking at. Or the dragon, the person who built that dragon statue on a mountain, the dragon statue that was bigger than a mountain. I mean, that to discover that, even if you knew it was coming, to, to, to head off towards it and see it come into view, that would be incredible. Whereas flying over it, you, you can see other aspects of it, but you, I think sometimes you lose some of that, oh, that reveal moment. But it's, it's one of those things that I have to accept that uh, I really have no choice. If I want to see even 1% of what you guys have built, 
I am going to need to um, just don't stream your journey. I might not. I might actually record the journey. That way nobody knows I'm doing it. Um, and I can even I can even log in completely anonymously. The only problem there is, generally speaking, it's nice to have a guide. So what I would need to do is talk to one of the moderators um, who has, you know, God powers and get a list of places they think I should visit and then just have them take me around to visit them and I can record them while no one knows. So I need the minimap mod. Yeah, I mean, this this is it. I might maybe, maybe what I should actually do is get some mods installed, maybe get a few people who know what's going on and just get the, get them to do a quick tour and uh, don't don't announce it so that we don't get swamped so you can sort of see these things in their natural element. It might almost be there's a little side of me wants to go in there invisible and just find people and see what they're building when you know like just 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 I don't know someone's building one of their monuments to just have have some footage of people just being just for the archives almost a few a few minutes of people just building stuff so so I could do maybe sped up videos but obviously as soon as I log in and everyone knows I'm there they all come teleporting to the main point and they stop doing anything um if if there weren't so many buildings lying around in minion land I would think all everyone did was hang around the cake stand jumping up and down shooting my building with flaming arrows because that's all I ever see <laughs> I'd I'd kind of like to see, you know. I mean that was I think in my mind I always imagined I would log into Minionland and then set off to do something and maybe discover something and everyone would be at their house and I'd be I'd be walking past and go, oh, what have you built? And they go, oh, hello, gopher. Uh, I have built such and such a thing and they'd show me round. And it would be more like I was a traveller in a village and yeah, you know, I mean that just didn't happen. <laughs> uh, it was like Yeah. I was a bit naive, I know. But, so, short version, quick recap. I am going to try and update my client. I can't promise I will, and I can't promise when. And I'm going to try and get in and take a look. Because I do enjoy it. I do enjoy seeing what you guys have made. But the server will be moving at some point. Hopefully it will be seamless. Hopefully you won't really notice it. So... Okay, Zed Black Blue. If you can give me, if you can give me recommendations on where to go, brilliant. So that's what I think I need to do. I just need to contact one or two people, and just um, meet them and go around and do some stuff. Yeah. Anyway, that, there you go. Let's 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 Minion Land off the list.